What is the book that they're... That they're since when do Jews and, uh, uh, Jews and Christians agree on the same book? Well, listen to what I'm saying. No, no. I'm asking you the question. Do Jews and Christians agree on the same book? They, they don't read, but they read the same book. La, 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 la. They don't read the same book. Right? Because what, what, what Christians... Oh, what, of course you'll be confused. The no. Testament. The Jews only have what is known as the Old Testament. They disregard the, the New Testament. It is not part of, the, it's not part of their book. Right? The, 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 the Christians have the, have the New Testament. Right? So... When, and, the, and the Old Testament. When Allah, of course you're confused. When Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala... Look, Jews, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala... Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is what do you call it talking about um w what the jews and the christians are doing okay now when they are saying that these guys are wrong and these guys are wrong right, hold on hold on a second you don't even know look, look yeah, have you read the tafasir you have you read it uh, have you read it tafasir look where is that where is that verse well i'll break down the verse for you what's the what's the reference Yes. How do you know it's Kitab. Kitab. And, uh, or No. Uh, what well, which one is it? Which one? What's the verse? What's, what's the verse? What you call your Joseph. is uh, Surah 2. I mean, chapter 2. Yeah. 113. 113. Yeah. Your one would be 113. Oh, oh no, yeah, because you. Because you don't say but, Bismillah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and we don't we don't count it, count it as a, you know. Bye. Sure. Right. Well, they, it doesn't say it doesn't say. Look, it says Wahom Yuthlun Al Kitab. Right. It doesn't say that they read the same book. Al Kitab means what? Scripture. So they both recite scripture. Right. Yeah. This is what Kitab means. Right. Wahom Yuthlun Al Kitab. Because uh, al, al Yahud, what do they believe in? A Torah. Yeah. What do Jews, what do Christians believe in? The Bible. No, al Injil, yeah. right? So they cannot be reading the same thing. So when he says, when Allah Subhanahu says, "Wa hum yutlun al Kitab," he's referring to the scriptures, right? I'm gonna listen to you. I'm gonna listen to the Quran. That's what the Quran is saying. I actually know the Arabic. Do you know the Arabic? No, but I. Don't. Then what? Then what? What you're saying is completely false. So you're telling me who actually understands the the, the Arabic language? Al-Kitab means scripture. It doesn't mean same book. Where did you get same book? No, no, hold on. Sorry a second. If it says same script, same book, it would say... N it would Read the Arabic, man. Read the Arabic. Don't come to me with your translations. Right? It doesn't say anything about them reading the same book. Okay? Brother, how do you understand the Quran? The Quran? Yeah, how do you understand the Quran? How do you understand the Quran? Yeah. If you don't understand... Well, well, same teacher Muhammad That's how we understand it. Well, Rasulullah Sallallahu said that there will be 30 liars that will claim prophethood, and yet you believe in uh, Mirza Ghulam. Muhammad Sallallahu also said there will be the Messiah who will come and will be the truthful. Yeah, the, who, who is a Messiah? Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam also said there will be 73 good, uh, uh, 73 Sex. in Islam, yes. and 72 will be wrong, and only one will be correct. Yeah, I know, this is a hell of sunnah. It's not... Uh, Ahlul Sunnah. And we, also, and we see that all the 72, they, they only accept one to be false. That's it. So we what? find that all the 72 are false. What are you on? No, no, no. no. Uh, al Masih, right, who you refer to as Mirza Ghulam Ahmed, uh, Rasulullah identified Al Masih as Ibn Maryam. What? Isa Ibn Maryam is Al Masih. Isa Ibn Maryam, the first, yes, he, he was a Masih, yes. No, he was, he is. Al Masih. It's yes. not. Okay, Masih. Yes. Al Masih means the Messiah. Okay, there yes. isn't another. There's not another Messiah. There isn't another Messiah. Where do you get the concept of another? Where does in the Quran? Where in the Quran does it mention a second Messiah? Where in the it's Hadith does it mention a second? Messiah. No, the Messiah is an identity. It's a title. Believe in another Messiah. Yeah. You don't believe in another Messiah. Meaning no, he believes in a second Messiah. Yeah, I do. He's a Qadiani. Answering me with a question. Do you believe in another Messiah? Straightforward question. But I have a question with him, man. Huh? I have a conversation with him, man. What do you call it? Look, what you what you think you're reading in the Quran is not what you're reading. And it says him that they read that they both read the scripture, right? Now the scripture is not being spe specified here, but the Jews don't believe in the Injil, so they they wouldn't be referring to the Injil. They wouldn't be reading the same book. But they didn't have okay? the Messiah concept. Yes, but the, for them, Jesus didn't fit fit the description of the Messiah. 
That's why they rejected him and rejected so the gospel. What's the concept of the Messiah then? We have the same uh, concept of the, uh, well, a similar concept of the, of the Messiah to the, uh, to the Christians, right? He was born of a virgin, he's done no, his no. miracles, he's a prophet. The second Messiah. There is no second Messiah. The, second the Jews Messiah. believe in two Messiahs. The, Ju the Jews believe in Messiah ben Yusuf and Messiah ben David. Okay? The Messiah ben David is Jesus. They believe in Messiah ben Yusuf who is meant to be killed. So you, the thing is, you don't know Jewish theology. Jewish theology... No, so you don't believe, look, look, listen, you don't believe Esau will come back? Esau will come back. So come. He's the same. Yeah, so we do believe Why? that. So would he be the Messiah? He is the Messiah. So where would he come from? He will come down from, he uh, from he uh, heaven. He will come from heaven? Yes. Where? Which land? Damascus. Damascus? Yeah. And the east on the, on the white minaret, east of Damascus. Okay, no, 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 that, but no, no, Isa is not an Arab. Would he be a Jew? Yes. A but he will. A Jew or a white Jew? Black or white Jew? No, okay, so when he comes what back. What do you call it? We, we, he's, he, was a, he was a Palestinian Jew. He would have been, but most likely, according to history, he would have been like his color. MashaAllah, he would look like Jesus. So that means. So that, so that no. means. How old would he be? How would you recognize him? How we, uh, uh, sorry, Rasulullah uh, told us how we would recognize him. Oh. He would be descending, okay? His hands on the wings of angels. He would descend on the white minaret. Okay, he, his clothes will be sort of a, a saffron color, right? His hair will be wet. It will look like it's wet, okay? So we have a description of, of how Isa is, uh, is going to uh, descend. Go on. <coughs> oh. I'm just me. Yeah. Wait, so when Isa comes back, yes. he will come from the heavens? Yes. With angels? Yes. Do you not believe this? So you, don't, so you don't believe what Rasul said explicitly? This is what Rasul said. So he, no, it's in a hadith, it's in a hadith in Sahih Muslim. So Jesus, when he comes... No, no, no. I'm asking you a very simple no, question. No, this is no, an no, this no, is a hadith. Just, no, 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 no. This no, is a, no. Uh, hold on. I want to clarify. No, right? I don't understand what you. Oh uh, no, but I no. I'm I'm telling you what is in the uh, in the hadith. I'm asking you. Narrated by Muslim. So when he comes authentic. Down, would authentic. He have nails in his hands. No. He won't have a hole in his hands. No. What about his feet? No, because he was never crucified. But he was put on the cross. No, he was never no. put on the cross. Never. Jesus was not put on the no. cross. No. وَمَا قَتَلُوهُ وَمَا صَلَبُوهُ When he says وَمَا صَلَبُوهُ, it means he was never put on the cross. Right? وَلَكِنْ شُبِّهَ لَهُمْ Where did you get this from? Because he got it from the Bible. It doesn't seem because, to be because he's taken, because he's taken, because Qadianis, look, Qadianis. I wasn't there, so I can't. Yeah. Qadianis. The, 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 the issue that the Qadianis have is that they've taken the Bible as an authority. Uh, Rasul has never taken the Bible as authority. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has never taken the Bible as authority. Why would you take it as an authority? So if anything, no. tahrif, the tahrif of the, the tahrif of the kitab, yeah, of al kutub actually, the tahrif of al kutub no, So why is in the Quran it says that he was it, crucified? It does. But he was saved. It does. It says, well, um, بَلْ رَفَعَ اللَّهُ so, Yeah. The, where is the only place you can get crucified? What do you mean it says? In Egypt actually. No, what? You can uh, you would get crucified in Egypt. Egypt uh, practiced crucifixion. But he was in Jerusalem. He was in Israel. No, he was in Fal in, in Jerusalem. Yeah, yeah. We don't recognize uh, Israel. Sorry, yeah. We we simply don't. All right. There's no there's no Israel. There's Palestine. So why did Jesus say I came for the lost tribe of Israel? As a people, not the land. Sorry. Israel is a person and the sons. Beni Israel are so, the children so of of, Jesus, of Jacob. When Jesus was in Israel, how many tribes? No, he wasn't in Israel. Where was right? he? Right. He was in Palestine, he was in when Jerusalem. He was, when he was in Jerusalem, he, yeah. when he was in Palestine, how, how, uh, he's teaching, how many, how many uh, disciples did he go to? We don't know the number. Well, you think 12? We're going to say 12 because it's in the Bible? No, we don't know the number. Yeah? Uh, uh, the Quran doesn't say al Nashr, al hawariyun al Nashr. It doesn't say that. It just says al hawariyun disciples. It doesn't give us a number. The thing is, you have prioritized the information in the Bible over the Quran. How many disciples was Jesus to come to? Disciples are basically companions, yeah, right? How many disciples was Jesus to come know. to? He came for he came for the all the all the Israelites, all the children of Israel. He came for all of them. How many followed him? Allahu alam. How many of them were his close companions? Allahu alam. No, they didn't. It was uh, it was the ones that disbelieved in him that condemned him.
But they say Look, he's not the Messiah. My advice to you is don't take the Bible as an authority. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala was very clear in the Quran that they have changed their scriptures. Why are you taking it as an authority? That's a, this is a sincere because question to you. Why? it was a book from God. Okay. Bear this in mind, okay? Isa, uh, Musa alayhi salam, when, he re, when, he, when the message came to him, okay? It came to him directly. The Old Testament is not what was given to Musa. Because the Old Testament in of itself has multiple authors. From, from uh, alleged, allegedly from Musa all the way to Prophet Daniel and Prophet Micah. Right, so the Old Testament can, cannot be described the as the Torah. The no, but the thing is, it's, it's misattributed because even in Deuteronomy, the thing is when you read uh, the, the five books, it's like a storybook. Only Leviticus is like a book of legislation. You know, Deuteronomy has a, a couple of prophecies. Exodus is more of a story of what happened to the, to the Israelites. It's more, it's more of a narrative, right? Where Moses is spoken of in the third person. So you can tell it's an outside perspective, right? But someone else has written this. The style is not the same, right? Moses' death is mentioned in the last book of Deuteronomy. So this cannot be something given to, uh, given to Moses or preached by Moses himself. Moses won't go around preaching what is happening to the Israelites when it's happening in front of them. Yeah, but he gave the law to the, the, the law. Yeah, he gave the Mosaic the, the, law. So this is why the Muslims, we always say that there are remnants of the original revelation in what they have. So but the totality, to no, we don't to adhere we don't adhere to it. it. We don't take it as an authority. We don't take it. There is truth from it. So now, however, it well. no, no, no. The Quran, the Quran is a criterion. No, no, hold on. The, the Quran is the criterion. So when we say there's remnants of truth, without the Quran, we would not be able to determine it. Because the Quran we believe to be, the, the Quran, the Quran will be, we believe to be God's word verbatim. So he knows everything. So which means when he tells us certain things that match with the Old Testament or match with the aspects of the New Testament, then we can say that those bits are true. The things that directly contradict the Quran, we say is false. And anything in between, we say we have no opinion of it. We cannot, we can neither falsify it or affirm it. So that's our criteria. No, but the, no, the thing is the Jews have admitted to, the, to them losing the Bible. Uh, the, the, the Torah. They, they admit to it in their writings. They, if you, they, they do, they have. If you, look in, if you look in the Mishnah, in the Talmud, even in the Bible itself, in the Old Testament itself, yeah, there is... The no, as in the Old Testament, right? They call it the Bible themselves, they, except they call it the Hebrew Bible, which means just getting rid of the New Testament. But they, they still call it a Bible, because Bible simply means a collection of books, right, exactly. And that's what the Hebrew Bible is. So, even in the Hebrew Bible, it there's a, there is an admission to the loss, uh, that, the, that the Torah has been lost. If anything, I can't remember whether it's Samuel or Chron or Chronicles, or well, one of the books in the Prophets. So what the hell uh, are they reading then in their synagogues if it's lost? They, they're doing what they could reconstruct, okay? What they could reconstruct. This is what they think. They actually base, what they read today, they base off a manuscript in the 11th century. Either the Aleppo, he's asleep. He's sleeping. No. No, what he said. No, so when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Where are you going? Jesus is saying, I mean, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran is saying that he was not crucified. Yeah. Because the reason why he says he's not crucified. Listen, listen. Listen, do you know a guy called Razi? Do you know a guy called Razi? No, because Razi is their top polemicist and I debunked him. Qadiani. No, no, Qadiani. Ahmadi. So they class themselves as Muslim? Yeah. But the, the, he, wanted to, he wanted to say that, what do you call it? Basically, in order for them to establish that Mirza Ghulam Ahmad is a prophet after Rasulullah, they need to kill off Jesus. Because Mirza Ghulam claimed to be the Messiah as well. And because he claimed to kill the Messiah, to be the Messiah, they had to kill off the real Messiah. They need to. And they don't believe in miracles. You say, this is why he said, he was like, oh, he's going to come with down, down with angels, stuck for Allah. This is not possible. Because they don't believe in they don't believe in angels, they don't believe in miracles. So that's why he won't answer questions. Oh, of course not, he won't. Of course he won't. So... It's not, it's not genuine conversation, then, is it? He does want to ask questions. Brother. So when 
Stop. Stop. Come here. Come here. How is he gonna walk? No. Like a normal human being. How is he gonna move? Normal. But he's gonna be over a thousand years old. No. It's gonna be. No. It's gonna be. It's gonna be his normal age. The age that he was. The age. No. See. Look. You're using the Bible again. See the. See the muffes. See the muff. See the mufassirin. The mufassirin. When it comes to the age of Isa alayhi salam, when Laman Rufa, right, when he was raised, they they have a they some of them say 33 because they use the Bible, right? Some of them say he was put around 40. Because what some of the scholars because some of the scholars have said that it was a tradition that the prophets would uh, that their mission will start at the age of 40. So there is discussion regarding his age. But however, the age is not important. The point is the age that he was when he was raised, that is the age he's going to be when he returns. In the same way, huh? this is what is inferred from the from the ahadith, because when he comes down, he will he will look the same. The hadith of Rasulullah it's, it's, it's in Sahih Muslim. Okay, I don't have the I don't have the sources of hand. I didn't know I was going to speak to a Qadiani today. You know, so go back and research it. Right, I'm not asking you to believe me. I'm just another Muslim in the park, right? Just go back and research it, okay? So according to you... No, no, not according to me, according to Islam, but I want you to no, research Islam, it. No, other, other Muslim people saying something different, completely different. Jesus was not put on a cross. No. He was risen up alive. Yes. When he comes back, he'll be the same age. Yes. Do you not believe it's possible? Hold on. Do you not believe it's possible for Allah to keep someone the same age? You don't think Allah has the ability to do that? He's so, ability, so he wouldn't do that. That's not his law. That's not his nature. No, no, but the, I was asking you about his the, the ability. Okay, has Allah got the ability to have a son? Has, has Allah got the ability to have a daughter? Why not? Because it's, a, it's against his nature. No, I'm not limiting it. Stop using Christian arguments. You're limiting his power. No, I'm not. Because when something is against the nature, it becomes a it becomes an automatic impo exactly. impossibility. It's against nature. No, against his nature. His nature. His nature. His nature is I oneness. One, la, la, la. one of his fingers against his nature is, is taking the human. No, no, no. La, 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 la. Anything In that Quran, anything. It says all living any, souls will suffer death. Where does it say? Is Jesus? Uh, la, la, la. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala is living, isn't he? If all living souls will taste death, is Allah gonna taste death? No, no, stop, stop misconstruing the Quran, Habibi. Huh? You said, no, no, you said all living things. Right. No, so now you're, now you're qualifying, right? But this is the thing. No, what I'm saying is you got to be careful with the Quran. Be careful with the Quran. Habibi, Habibi, Allah. Allah. Just, just, no, it's fine. Ignore it, right? Look. One question I want to hear you answer. One. I've answered it. One, one, one. I've answered him so many questions. Okay, answer, no. Ask him one. So, one question. Hold on. It was, I was in the flow. You interrupted the flow. Let that guy speak. I was in the flow. Um, look. The, the, the Bible is not your standard. Okay. The Quran is. Can we agree on this? The Quran is our standard. Quran is first. The Quran is our standard. But okay. If we cannot find the truth meanings, or we cannot, if you want to look at uh, certain resources, then we can look at the Bible. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Shuf, shuf, shuf. Are you okay? No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Bro, your brain is gone. Brothers, brothers, brothers. Come on. Let me, let me, let me converse. Let me converse. Let me converse. Yeah. Guys, come on, come on, come on. Five. No, come here, come here. What's your name? 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 Muhammad as well, okay. Yeah, Muhammad. You know, I'm very limited. Muhammad. Just, just, look, just, just, uh, just work with me. Forget everyone else, okay? Are you teaching wireless? Are you teaching wireless? No, come. Hey, bro, is he teaching wireless? I don't, I didn't hear him. I didn't hear him. Yeah, look. Just concentrate on the concentrate on what we're saying. Okay, look, the Quran is our standard, right? Now, when the Quran is making, the Quran is the, the Quran, the Quran is Muhammad. The Quran is Muhammad, right? It is the criterion to judge the other scriptures. So when when Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says wa ma qataluhu wa ma salabuhu, right? That means he, these things did not happen to him. So if the Bible says he got crucified, we know that's false. 
because of a crucifixion. Yeah, look at the Quran says he's false. Yes. yes. Right. So he wasn't crucified. But the question, yes. But what the question is, what happened when he was on the when he was on the cross? He wasn't on the cross to begin with. He was never put on the cross. You don't even believe he's on the cross. He he never he never get on the cross. He was okay. Time, sure. Look, do in in Surah Al-Maida, right? It talks about. Well, and Maida, well, right? We, the, the, we cannot move forward because you okay, don't no. believe that Jesus is in the cross. We can move forward because because we're establishing that the Quran is, is being very clear that he was never on the cross. Right? Here's, look, here's something, right? Do you know do you know look, all right, let me show you something, right? Do you know why hold on Akhi. No. It says in the Quran, brother. Muslims don't believe this. Yes, of course. Fully? Yes. Without any doubt? Yes, of course. Does the Quran say that Jesus was not crucified? Yes. So why are you not believing that? We do believe that. So no, no, hold oh, no, 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 The Qadianis believe this. Look. They don't believe do you know how the Qadianis believe that? He does not believe. You believe the Quran was... Is Habibi. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Brothers, 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 brothers. But the thing is... Does the Bible say brothers. The Quran, the, the, the I'm trying to get somewhere with them. If the, if, the, if the Quran is saying that Jesus has been changed. No. If the Quran is saying that Jesus was not They're crucified, making a video yeah. or let him that make means video, that Jesus must have been on the cross. No. no. Look, look. You don't understand that. No, no, look. Look, look. <laughs> look, look. Listen, listen, listen. Listen, Muhammad. 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 He has white hair. Does that mean he has white hair? No, Muhammad. If he has listen. white hair, then yes, he's a white hair. So Muhammad. Black hair, so he's black hair. Muhammad. But you know, people don't Muhammad. understand that Jesus Muhammad. was on the cross. Muhammad. Jesus was not sacrificed. Muhammad, no, 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 please. I know that. Please. please. But Jesus was on the cross. Oh, right, brothers, please, come on. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get somewhere. Yeah, but you, uh, but brothers, if you guys are talking, he's, you can see that he gets easily distracted. So, just, you know. You know, you're not making sense. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Right, look, okay, so in your belief, in your belief, when, why you, okay, look, I know why you say he hasn't grown. Why are you looking at my phone? He's saying, be careful. Yeah. So, well, I know what I know you what your belief is. When you say when you say that you believe in the Quran, look, when you say when you say that you believe in the Quran and that you believe that Jesus wasn't crucified, you're talking about he didn't die on the cross. Right. See, this is what Allah is, is rejecting, and this is why. When Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, why does he say Why doesn't he just say Yeah? Why doesn't he just mention crucifixion? Well, because crucifixion. No, 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 no. Okay. You're telling me what the Jesus Christians think. No, you're telling me what Christians believe. You're if not you telling me what Muslims believe. believe. If you Habibi, believe Jesus was put on the cross, then work with me. Say. Work with me, right? In the Jewish, in, in the Talmud, right? The Jews have said that Jesus died. Uh, what do you call it? One account says that he died on crucifixion. One one account says that he died by hanging. Okay. So don't think that the, that the story of the crucifixion of Jesus is unanimous. The Talmud rejects it. So they believe that he was stoned and hanged. All right? The, the, there is a... Ta the Jesus. Yes. Jesus was stoned and he was hanged. No, he wasn't. He wasn't. Yes, he was. He wasn't so Hanging and crucifixion is different. We're talking about with the noose. No, oh, no, no. Right. Because you're using again Christian term. Yeah, he Jesus, was hung on a pole. Jesus was Look, hanged. Yeah, they I, say a pole. Yeah. yeah, hung on a pole. Deuteronomy yeah. 22, yeah, which yeah. Paul then misconstrued it and made it look like Jesus was a curse for them. I know exactly where you're going, yeah. right? The point here is the Jews didn't say hanging as in hung on a pole. Right? Because if anything, the one who is hung on a pole in Deuteronomy de deserves that punishment. Christians don't believe that he deserved that punishment. Right? This is why this is why Paul misconstrues the argument. Well, right? And, and the verse. The Jews say if you hang on the pole and you die on the pole, then you're a cursed man. Yeah, because That's you deserve the, the because you deserve the punishment. Do you believe that Jesus deserved it? No. Right. So he to be hung, to be put up in the first place. It's, it doesn't say about dead. It doesn't say about death. It doesn't say if you die, then you are cursed. No, it says any uh, a man who's hung on a pole is cursed. It doesn't mention about death. He doesn't have to die to be. No, he does have to die. No. Yes. No, that's not what the verse says. So you're you're adding says, on to the verse. No, no, no. No, what it means? Go to Deuteronomy 22. If you die, uh, Habibi, go to Deuteronomy yeah, 22. I'm telling no. you what it says. You can look it up brother. yourself. Brother. It says if you die on the pole, if you die on the cross, then you are a cursed man. Sorry? That's what it says. 
it does not say if you just hang on and that's it. No, it says if you die on it. If we live, would then it could be burned. Sorry? If we live, would then it could be burned. No, the anguish verses. No, you can touch it. They don't mix any sense. It's translation. They don't made it up. What can you do? Translation of the Quran. It's not the same one, yeah. It's stressing. That's why the Jews said that Jesus died on the cross. Because he said, who's the cursed man? No, it's not Deuteronomy, sorry, not Deuteronomy 22. Yeah, you can repent all about it. Jesus, you might give me a But he doesn't believe that Jesus was even put on the cross. Sorry, it's 21. Deuteronomy 21, 23. And it says, what do you call it? His body shall not remain uh, all night upon the tree, but shall in. Uh, no, that's not it. Wait, on. Tree from my 22. 21 to me. I apologize. Yeah, you're right. You're, you're correct. You know? Die, he, what do you call it? If he dies on a pole, he is cursed. But it's because he's deserving of that curse. Oh, yeah, you're, you're correct. So, the thing is. Like I said, Paul still misconstrues this because then he says that he then makes it look like um, Jesus deserved that, right? And that's not what Deuteronomy 21 says. Huh? Who was Paul? Some guy. Do you, please don't believe, please don't tell me that you believe that he was an actual apostle. Paul was a um, Roman. He was a spy. No, he was a Jew. Or a Jew. He was a Jew. He, he used no, he killed Christians. He used to spy on Jesus. No, he, he wasn't. He never met Jesus. He used to spy on Jesus. No, he never met him. He never spied. He, he never spied on him. He never knew the man. Where did you get this idea that he used to spy on Jesus? Paul came after Jesus. Okay. Yeah. What do you call it? Paul. Paul was alive while Jesus was preaching, but he never met him. All right. Never met him. Never believed in him. All right. Bottom line is, when Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says in the Quran, "Wama qataluhu," it's because the Jews believe that he was stoned and and hung, right? And then they have another one where it says he was just crucified. That's it. They don't even mention the scourging. They don't actually mention the scourging, right? And according to the to the gospel, he wasn't stoned. He was scourged whipped and everything he wasn't actually stoned like like jewish stoning that's not what happened to him right so there are two accounts of what happened of how jesus died okay and they don't hold up right even the biblical account doesn't hold up to historical scrutiny and you're holding that as some as some sort of thing so allah is actually making it very clear that he was never killed in any manner that the jews describe and he wasn't crucified, as the Christians believe. Rather, it was made to appear so. And Allah took him up. Where? So, what? What do you mean where? Where was Jesus? Where was Jesus? He, Allah says it, he was raised up. Before so, life. Yes. Go to every major scholar, right? And they will tell you the same thing. Yeah? Now Isa Urtufa' Hayyan. Read the scholars. So Jesus went up alive. He went up alive. And he was put to sleep. What about, what about right? Allah is making it very clear. I am putting you to sleep and raising you up to myself. And we know the way we know exactly where he is. He is in the second heaven. How do we know this? Because when Rasul, do you believe that Rasul went to uh, did the Isra al Miraj? You believe that he went up to the heavens? It was, a, it was a physical. Yes. He got on the Barak. He, he went to uh, to, uh, to Jerusalem. He led all the prayers. Uh, he led all the prophets in prayer. In, in message. Uh, yeah. And then he went up. And he met Isa alayhi salam in the second heaven. You believe that as well? Yes. The one went up alive. Physically. Yes. yes. See, the problem is that the Qadianists don't believe in miracles. You don't believe in miracles. Let's be honest. 
Let's not shy away from what you actually believe. Yeah, don't you don't believe, believe in miracles. False fantasies. You believe in hadiths. Safrullah, see? No, Safrullah. So when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala relates the story of us, of the people in the cave, you don't believe it? What do you mean it's dreams? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying it happened. No, no, no. Uh, you said, you said, no. No, who said that? Who said that? He was sitting near the Kaaba. No. He was laying his back. Look, Abu Bakr was laying down. Abu Bakr, la, la, la. Jibreel came to him. La, Jibreel. Jibreel came to him. Jibreel came to him and woke him up. Jibreel came to him, he showed him a dream. No, he didn't show him a dream. Where, where does it say he was showing a dream? It doesn't say he was showing a dream. It's a physical reality. It's not a fantasy. What about the miracles? That, uh, yeah, no, but this is what I'm saying. Look, yeah, yeah, like, I said, like I said, like I said, let's be transparent. The Qadianis do not believe in miracles. You call them fantasy. Uh, look, I've, I've, been going, I've been going back and forth with Razi for, for a while. Okay? And I know you know who he is. Okay? And he cannot refute me. He had to run from me, he had to block me and everything. Hazrat Isa also said there will be a sign of uh, Prophet Jonah. Bible. Do you know that the sign of Jonah doesn't fit? Even if we use, let us, look, I will use the biblical standard with you, right? And you'll still watch it fall apart. The sign of Jonah was meant to, give, uh, was meant to be given to who? The Pharisees. Yeah, because the Pharisees asked for it. Hazrat Isa ibn Marim said, I will have one of the signs of the Prophet Jonah. No. Where does it say that in the Quran? Where does it say that in the Sunnah? So like I said, you're, you're taking this from the Bible. But let's go with the Bible. He says, you will, ha you will have no sign but the sign of Jonah. Who does he say this to? He says this to the Pharisees. Okay, yeah. When does he ever show them the sign? He did. When? What sign? What was the sign of Jonah? What was the sign of the Jonah? The sign of the Jonah was? Not the Jonah, Jonah's a person. Jonah. Well, the sign of Jonah, Jonah was that he was in the well, the belly of the well for three days and three nights, right? Jonah, Prophet Jonah, yes. he went to the belly of the well, yeah. alive. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. And he came out, out of the belly alive. alive. Right, okay. This was a sign of Esau. Yeah. That was put, no, that was a sign of uh, Jonah, yeah. which was put on Esau. Yeah. The sign of, of Jonah on Esau was yeah. he went on the cross alive and he came off the cross alive. Really? Is that, yes. a miracle? Is that, is that, is that doable? What happened? What? No, 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 no. Do you know why it's not doable? Because the Romans will never take you off unless you're dead. What? The Romans will not take you off the cross unless you're dead. Cru what was the method of crucifixion? Crucifixion was to, was suffocation. When was Jesus put on the cross? What day was it? Oh, you don't believe it was on the cross. No. Oh. What, what, what day? No, go, tell me what day. It was on a Friday. No. Are you sure? Of course. Are you sure? Jesus was put on Friday. Uh huh. And Pilate. Was it on the preparation? Pilate commanded his, uh, his empire, his people. His people? Uh. To, to put Jesus, the Romans, to put Jesus on the cross on Friday. Do you know the other gospel? Do, do you know there's another the gospel? Next day was a Sabbath day. No. <laughs> so, in a way, Pilate also wanted Jesus to actually live. So he purposely put Jesus a day before on the cross, uh, Jesus on the what cross. What does the Bible say about Jesus on the cross? You know? The this is why the Quran says he was not killed on the cross. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, the, but yeah, the Bible says he died. Well, the Bible says he died. The, cross. the Bible Never says, look, look. <laughs> the Bible says he died on the cross. If you want to take the yeah. Bible as a standard. No, but we don't believe that. No. See, the thing is, you can't just cherry pick. Why not? Right? Because you're cherry picking without a, without a criteria. Subhanallah. The, the point here is, right? If you want to use this prophecy of the sign of Jonah in the Bible, it also records that he died on the cross. That nullifies that prophecy. It's now you, prophecy. now you changing it up, right? And then saying he got off the cross and then went to Kashmir. Yeah. That's what happened. Where's the, where's the, where's the evidence that he was in course, Kashmir? And don't tell me about his grave in Kashmir because there isn't one. There is one. No, there isn't. Yes, there is. Google the, it right now. You find it. Wow. I've seen, uh, yeah, there's, it's actually someone else, it's actually someone else's grave, but the Qadianis have claimed it to be Jesus's grave. And the family of the person, the family of the person whose grave it belongs to, they've actually come out and said, this is our son's grave. But they hide that fact. Don't, don't give me this stuff. I know the ins of, uh, I know the ins of out. Okay, this is what they believe. They believe that, they believe that Isa, look, they believe that Isa, 
They believe that Isa Alayhisalam died at the age of 120, right? Because they believe that uh, that um, Yahya lived to the age of 240. Why do they believe that? Because uh, the Qadiyanis believe that every prophet, half his age. So every time they had a prophet, it was, he would live half the age of the other. I have not heard of this, but we know... Look at your sources, look at your sources. We know Jesus. Huh? No, no so, so every prophet, 120. So he was 120 years old. So, so basically, he got off the cross. He got off the cross. And tell me this: you believe you believe that he, you believe that Isa salam was healed by some sort of potion. Jesus. Yeah, that his wounds were healed by some sort of potion. Yes or no? We know from the Bible. No, you don't know anything from the Bible because but the Bible doesn't say the, the, the Bible doesn't say that he got that he got off the cross and went to Kashmir. So you don't know this. He's a Qadiani. We, we, okay, Bible. is a true Islam. La. Okay, yeah, yeah. True Islam. Better for the doubt, yeah. Hundred percent. Yeah. Sunnis uh, are not hundred percent Islam. Okay. Yeah, just, okay. Do you understand? Does it really count as Your a sect? If it's kafir, it's just straight up out of the fold of Islam. Uh, they, okay. They're kufara. Because you, no, they don't have any. They believe. They disbelieve in in, in Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Rasulullah Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said that he is the last of the Anbiya. They believe in on, in a Nabi after him. Mirza Ghulam Muhammad. That are teaching you about Islam. That came from uh, from India. Our knowledge comes from uh, the, uh, from the Quran, from the Sunnah of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Who taught the people that taught us the Sunnah, sunnah yeah. is the Caliph. I'm a Muslim. He's not. The Messiah. What? Yeah. See, his 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 movement. They claim to be Muslim, but they but they violate Muslim core beliefs. Like the finality of the Prophet, people peace be upon him, the fact that God can perform miracles. These core things <laughs> are things that they disbelieve in, so they can't be identified as Muslims. You don't believe in this, this Bible. You exactly. You don't believe in the Quran. Yeah. Do you, believe in the Quran? you don't. You do. You don't. What part would you do? You don't believe that Jesus did not die. Yeah, so. He didn't die. Exactly. Yeah. So you don't believe in the Quran there? The Quran says he didn't. Where does it say that? Show me. The same verse. What does it say? What? Show me where does it say. 4, 157. Show me where does it say Jesus did not die. Okay. You can't. Where does it say they did not die? Where does it say they did not die? Where does it say they did not die? Let me read it to him. I know because I've dealt with their movement already. Seven, yeah? Listen. Listen. Indeed, we have killed Rock, yeah? And for their saying, yeah, their saying, not their, you know who they're Brother, talking you about. You have to show me where it says Jesus has not died. Look, look, no, this is what he said. Look, he Allah is refuting. Alive. Look, Allah is refuting. He says, look. Show me where it says he went up alive. Show me. I want to see a clear verse where he says he Chapter 3, verse 155. Uh, sorry, verse 55. Verse 55. You know that they crucify him, yes. but another was made in yes. that. No, 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 no. Yes. Don't say another one. That's not in the Arabic. Another one. It's not in the Arabic. In the Arabic, it doesn't say another one was made to. Was made. It just says. Seems to appear. This is this is putting tafsir into it. Yeah. Right. So that's that's uh, so incorrect. By the time I had to explain to him, it's going to be. <laughs> yeah, but show. Sure. You cannot show me anyway. Where it's, it's just there. Like okay. So when it when it says, let, let's let's bring up the verse, right? Show me where it says. Hold up, Habibi. Hold up. Four one. So the translation here is wrong. <laughs> yeah, the translation's wrong. <laughs> Who said that? We've been handling oh. this the whole time. Fine. Wakala hum. All right. Listen carefully. Yeah, how long was it? Yeah, Muhammad. 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 Alhamdulillah, it's a good book. Yeah. You know, Kashmir, you know the heaven is closer. No. It's more like a human being will go to heaven. The mountain in Sri Lanka is higher than Kashmir. In Nepal. Mount Everest is higher. And that's in Nepal. So Mount Everest is closer. La la la, Safarullah, Safarullah. What do you call it? What do you him? Look. Allah has been saying him. He's saying here. وَقَوْلِهِمْ إِنَّ قَتَلْنَا Right? That we have killed. المسيح عيسى ابن مريم رسول الله وما قتلوه Right? So this is already saying that he's alive. Because he's saying to the Jews. The Jews are saying in their boss, we've killed him. Yes. And what does he say? No, they, not they didn't kill him. Yes. So what do you want to say? So when he's away, but then when he says, uh, what do you call it? ولكن شو بيقولنا وين الذين اختلفوا فيه إلا في شك من وما لهم به من علم إلا تبع بن. 
طيب رائع قليل رائع قليل So very the very next verse. So he says he's already refuting them. He's saying uh, right? He could not show me. Hold on. Then he says. Then he says. Then he says. Bell. Bell. Rafa'u wallahu ilay. Rafa'u. Yeah. Rafa'u means. To raise. Rafa'u is to raise. To, to lift someone up. Ra is a letter. Ra is a letter. Rafa. Uh, I speak Arabic. Also yeah. means? So, Rafa means race. <laughs> I know where you're coming from. You're talking about in status. Rahu. It also means Rahu. What? Yes. The word? Yes, is Arabic. Read Arabic. Rauf? Bring out. Yes. You mean Rauf? Yes. Rauf. Rauf is an attribute. It's an attribute of Allah. No. Rauf. Rauf and Rahim. Soul. It means Rahu. No. Ruh. Yes. Ruh is, is a <laughs> Ruh is a completely different root word to Rafa. Rafa, no, no. no Rafa. He will know. You won't know. I'm an Arab. He's an Arab. You're an Arab. Yes. I'm from Saudi. He's from Saudi. I'm from Yemen. Look at the word. I read it. And you will see. Yes, yeah, Saudi, 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 Saudi. Read Saudi it. Saudi word would know more. Read what? That word. What he's talking about? When what's been raised is the spirit, the Rahu. No. It's no. Rahu. No. Where Look does, at. Where does it say ruh? It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. It, there, there is no. There is no connection between the rafa and the ruh in, in linguistically. Is rafa is ruh. Yeah. Yeah. It is a connection. There is, a connection. There is no connection. Read, read the Arabic word. Connection you between me. Have you have you studied the Arabic language? Have you studied? I've not studied it, but I know but, people Habibi. Have studied it. No, like who? Razi. I know people who have studied it. Which verse? I'll read it. Which read it. it. Which verse? Oh, yes, I. He's saying, Bel -ra he's saying this one. Bel -ra Allahu ilay. He's saying that this has got a connection with the Ruh. If his, if his Ruh went up, look, look, look. If the Ruh went up alone, that means he would have died. Do you understand that? You don't even believe in the Quran. Do you believe that Jesus was crucified? How can you let an Indian, an Indian man that lives in the, 18th, in the 19th century do this to you? How have you let Mirza Ghulam Muhammad do this to you? Mirza Ghulam Muhammad is the second coming, he's the Messiah. He's not the Messiah. Of course he's the Messiah. No, no he's not. Yes, he's this is why you need to kill off uh, Isa alayhi salam. Because you need, you need, oh, well no, this is why they do it. Mirza Ghulam Muhammad is the second coming, he's he, the Messiah, he's a prophet. What did he do? Okay, type. What, what is the, what is, he's not Ali Muhammad, Al Mahdi, Al Mahdi, Al Mahdi and Masih, they two different the people. The prophet was a seal of the prophets. Well, first go find me the words. Then you no, 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 hold on. Okay. Al Mahdi. Why are you running away from my question? Because you don't have that's common fourth, sense. That's the fourth question. Common sense. Uh, common sense. Let's talk common sense. Let, common sense. No. I just gave you, I'm sorry, but you don't have common sense. In English, Let. this guy, my brother here, he said in Arabic. Hmm. Now you're trying to change the word in Arabic. Language. I told okay, you, show me where does it say he went up alive. And you still haven't showed me. What, you want it explicit? I want explicit. You want it? Subhanallah. <laughs> so when Allah is saying they haven't killed him, but he was raised up, you want to say that he, he died? Maybe in order raised he might, up, he might As I told you, the only thing that was raised up was his soul. Well, soul. Do you know what? Do you know what? Okay, is that what you believe? No, no, hold on, hold on. So if his body, if his body remained, hold on. If his body remained on earth and his soul was raised up, raised up do you know what that means? It means he died. Of course he died. Yeah, but you're saying he died. <laughs> well, no. Let me ask you a question. Look at the context. Let me ask you a question. Look at the context. No. Look at the context, right? First of all, Rafa'a and Ru' they have no connection linguistically. I will tell you, I'll tell you the word. I'll tell you. InshaAllah, SubhanAllah. Qadiani. Ahmadiyya, yeah. Ex Qadiani. Come, come, come. He knows, he knows, he knows he more Islam than all of you. He, yeah, yeah, he's a Hello Sunnah. No, no, he lies so much. I know. <laughs>
You may believe it. <laughs> and he lies so much. And he's he hard. He knows well, the I've, I've dealt with the Qadianis for he, about two years. Alhamdulillah, I know. I went to him to him. I said, are you Qadiani? He said, no. He was lying. Yeah. You know. And now he's lying know, again. Yeah. I showed him everything, you know, from his book. Yeah. He said, I don't know. Yeah. yeah. Which one? Rohanani Khazayan? No, no, no. Which one? Shaitani Khazayan. Shaitani Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I call them Shaitani Khazayan. That. Allah, even in, the thing is, in, uh, when, no, it, when no, it comes no, to Khatim, no, when it comes no, to Khatim al no, right? No, Mr. No, Ghulam Ahmed no, himself, no, when he's, no, when he's no, referring to Isa, no, no, he says, Khatim al illa Bani Israel. That's what he says. They don't believe Which means they the they last of the prophets to Bani Israel. But then when it comes to Khatim al when it comes to Muhammad, he's like, they don't believe that. There's a prophet after him. No, never in the Quran. Show them, show them the cross. We show them. Never put on the cross. If somebody didn't put on the cross, how he die? We show them. They don't believe. The Isa alayhi salam. He is high. He is alive in the heavens, in the second heaven. And he will descend yeah. upon the white minaret yeah. in the east of Damascus. He doesn't. He doesn't. I know he will say yes, but because he's twisting the word seal. I do have. Because khatim and seal means like the best of something in the Arabic language as well. There's a connotation there. So they play with the connotations of the Arabic language. If you can, if you can debate with uh, Arabic language, you must. They can't. They can't. They can't. Of course, is So means the end of Yes, but what does mean? See? Allah, you do it's the end of Rasul, the end of messengers. So why did Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam say if my uh, son Ibrahim was still alive, he would have been a prophet? No, he said no, no, he never said that. He didn't actually say that. He never said that. He said, he said, he said if there was going to be a prophet after me, it would have been Umar ibn Khattab. He said if. If, but, what did he finish the sentence? Okay. What did he say? So he said, he but, so I am the last that? of the prophets and there is no one after me. So why did he even say that then? Huh? Why did he even claim that there could be a prophet To there? give the status of... To, to, uh, to get people to understand the status of, 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 of Umar ibn Khattab. You don't know what makes sense. Umar ibn Khattab, the shaitan was afraid of Umar ibn Khattab. Yeah, <laughs> this is the status of Umar ibn Khattab. Yeah. Uh, when, uh, when Umar ibn Khattab was walking here, the shaitan was over there. Also, why is it in the, one of the hadiths it says... The what? Hadith. Yeah. Hadith. It has said... That, that. <laughs> no, no, I'm, I'm, Wait, uh, I'm not mocking, I'm not mocking. If you're going to use Arabic language, use that. Yeah, I'm correcting you. Because hadith, you know... Look, what did they say? There has, there, there, there's some verses that I've given you from the Quran that you didn't even know. <laughs> what do you mean I didn't know? Yes, there was two free so uh, No, I, not knowing the reference is different to know. not knowing the ayah. First of all, first and foremost, okay. I'm not a hafid. Secondly, I haven't memorized every reference. Thirdly, and I know my Quran. So much. Yeah. yeah. We know the Quran. I know where you're going before you even get to it, Habibi. Yeah. No more messenger. Yeah. The thing is, what would you what you guys are forgetting? You you talk about uh, Khatim and Khatim. Khatim and Khatim, right? Where's the Quran? The, the, you have, we have the... No, no. Khatim and Nabiyin means... No, Khatim. Khatim. No, no. Khatim means seal. of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam's teachings. Yeah. The Sunnah. Yeah. The Quran. Yeah. The seal of everything. This is all seal. Yeah. Yeah, it's finished. It does not mean... Including, uh, including so his prophet. It does not mean the prophet cannot come. What a seal means. You know, you know, okay, look, look. You know, have been lied to. La! You have been deceived. You know, Do you know, okay, look, look. In Ruhani Khazayin, right? Mirza Ghulam Ahmed actually speaks yeah. about Isa A.S. being the final prophet to the to the Jews, right? La la la! Check it out yourself. It's the Ruhani Khazayin. I know your books. This guy knows your books. I know your books, and he and he says in the Arabic. No, he says in your books. He says in your books that Isa 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 ibn Maryam Khatim al Anbiya Khatim al Khatim al Anbiya or al Nabiyin ila. Uh, Ila Bani, uh, Bani Israel. Ruff. It says this in, in uh, Raf. He's Saudi Arabia. Do you know what Raf means? This guy, this guy knows the language. Uh, Ask Raff him means the question. Ask him. Uh, yeah, Raf. Ask him. You're not listening to Raf. Shelf. Or... Yeah, shelf. Shelf. Yeah. <laughs> No, Check out, you know what? I, I wish I had, I wish I had the sources now. Rohani Khazayin. 
Let me see if I got my screenshot somewhere. Hey, brother, what, you know, uh, why is Gideon is funded by the Jews? Bro, your brain was the most there. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, I, I think you're probably Al Qaeda, bro. That's how bad it is for you, man. Al Qaeda? Who's Al Qaeda? What is Al Qaeda? You know what Al Qaeda is? No, no, no. no. I, I don't no, do you know? Do you know that we are actually the Qadianis actually believe Qadianis believe that Ahlu Sunnah are terrorists. Do you know why? Do you know why they say this? This is what you. This is what your movement believes, and I'm not saying you personally. How can you say that? No, you. No, I'm saying your your movement believes that Ahlu Sunnah. Do you know why? Do you know? Do you know? I'm not making this up. I'm not making this. I tell you why. Because Razi accused me of being a terrorist. Do you know why? Who Razi? Razi, the guy in Canada. Right? How many answers? He, he, you know him. He said that you was a uh, he, terrorist. Yes, he called me a terrorist. Do you know, terrorist? Right, I'll tell you why he called me a terrorist, right? He called me a terrorist because I said when Isa a.s. will descend, he will wage war. Okay? He will wage... No, this is in the hadith! It's in the hadith! So when he will, comes back... Well, when he wakes up... Yawda al-Jizya. After 2,000 years... Yawda al-Jizya. Okay. He will have a war. Yeah. yeah. So basically, when when, uh, when Isa alayhi salam returns, the sign. So look, look in in the Quran, in the Quran. No, they believe. The thing is, here's the thing. Look, look, can you not look? Think, think for a second. Think for a second. If Mirza Ghulam, if Mirza Ghulam, if Mirza Ghulam was the Messiah, if Mirza Ghulam was the Messiah, Habibi. No, wait, 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 wait. Uh, no, I want to get through to the brother. Look, I want you to think. I want you to think. If Mirza Ghulam was the... He affirmed the hadith of Rasul about the Messiah, right? And what he was going to do. Why do you think that Mirza Ghulam's son had to build a white minaret in Qadian? The white minaret was already there. No, he wasn't. It was actually built during the lifetime of... Uh, of uh, According to this, he's going to be... He's going to, he's going to come from east of Damascus near a white mineral. Yeah. No. And we see the Qadian uh, on the, the white mineral there. No. East of Damascus. Built by who? Built by who? This is what we know. No. Okay? Built by who? It was, it it was, was commissioned... Built. No, it wasn't already built. No, was it was built commissioned by? and built by... What do you call it? By, uh, and the construction began at the time of Mirza Ghulam. Mirza Ghulam died prior to the completion of the white minaret in Qadian. Check the history. I did a whole stream. I did, I did like five streams of Qadianis. All right, check out my streams. Right, check out Yemenite. Check out my channel, Yemenite Front. I went through. I actually did a stream on one of the prophecies. Do you believe that the Do you believe that the prophecy of uh, of uh, Mirza Ghulam about when he's gonna die came true? Mirza Ghulam made a prophecy about his own death. Huh? Yeah, he made a prophecy of his own death. He said, I will, I will die between the ages of, uh, uh, what do you call it? 80 and 85. Where did he say this? You need to. No, 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 no. Okay, so this, hi no, no, so this idea of Mirza Ghulam dying. No, hold on. Let me clarify. Let me clarify. I don't want to do injustice to their movement. That when no, no. So what happened is, he died from uh, uh, chloria, right? Yeah, he died from a disease. Now what happened is, or to call it, uh, when he was dying, he defecated himself. But he was in bed, right? He was in his bed, but he defecated himself because of the disease. So people who mock the Qadiani movement, they say he died on on a toilet, like on a. But he actually died in bed. But he did defecate, all right? So that is the reality of how he died. Yeah, of course. I'm not going to do injustice to your movement. No, no, at least, you know, you stood there, at least told one truth, you know. Because you see all around us, there are people lying, you know. And you're telling no, the, no, at least no. you're telling the one part. Like I said, one, I know your one, movement. I know your beliefs. One thing that you said to the truth. Look, Mohammed, what do you call it? Uh, 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 if you are sincere, I, I, I invite you to check out my channel because I have, I've actually done some material on, on, on uh, your movement, right? I've done a few streams, okay? Now, one of the streams that I've done uh, most recently was about the, uh, about the prophecies of Mirza Ghulam Ahmed. All right. You know about the Mubahala they had before? Yeah, and it failed. He died two weeks after that as well. Yeah, um, bye. They both went to curse each other. The scholar. Right. So, uh, so, prophet so this is my actually this is my video, yeah. Prophetic tragedies, Mirza uh, Ghulam. I had to re-upload it because of something. All right. I want no. Look, you can say Audi Billah, fine. But I want you to look at this, right? Check it out, 
and you will see that I actually break down his prophecies and explain why they don't, why they're not fulfilled. A uh, Yemenite front. Let me ask you a question. Why is it that Iraq? I'll put it in for you if you Iran, want. Iran, Syria, no. Afghanistan. Yeah. These all are Sunni countries. Yes. Why is it that all of these countries were not protected by the uh, Saudi government? Why is it that when America... Because the Saudis had... Lola, don't, don't, no, 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 shuf, shuf, shuf. I don't want to, don't shift the, don't shift yeah, the conversation into Khalifa. You're, you're shifting the conversation into, it, into a conversation of Khalifa. Why is it that Saudi Arabia are funding Israel and America? Why is it they that they don't, 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 they don't
to another human being. You just said the same thing. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. I because I'm referring to the same person. I'm talking about Isa ibn Maryam. Isa ibn Maryam would descend. If when he comes back, would he still have the title of prophet? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Because he was... Same thing what we believe. No, you don't believe that. You don't believe that Isa is coming back. As the prophet said, you believe there's another breathing prophet. Habibi, you look, you don't believe that Isa is going to come back. You don't believe he's going to come back. You, yeah. Ali Salam, say Ali Salam, he's a prophet. Bro, you lot don't make sense. You lot are saying the same thing as me. No, we're not. No, you're not. You're saying you're saying that the title of Messiah is transferred from Isa Alayhi Salam to Mirza Ghulam. Right. That's not what we're saying. We're saying that the same Isa Alayhi Salam is coming back. There is no Mirza Ghulam. And when he comes back, he's gonna be he's gonna wake up. And he's going to have uh, angels all beside him. Beside him. Two angels. He's going to be 40 years old. He said that uh, we don't know his age. We don't know his age. We don't know what age he's going to be. He's going to... Okay. Did, did Mirza Ghulam uh, kill the Dajjal? Did Mirza Ghulam kill the Dajjal? Slowly, slowly he is, yes. What do you mean he is? What is the Dajjal? No, no, sure. No, no. What is... No, what is the Dajjal? Who is the Dajjal? Don't tell me it's Russia. You're saying it's Russia, I'm going to tell you what the Jal is. Jal Bhai. Jal Bhai. Jal Bhai. Jal is something that deceives you. Okay? So... The Jal is a human being. The Sahaba, there is a, there is a, there is a group of the Sahaba that met him. The Jal is a deceiver. It deceives people. Okay? It's a system at the moment. It's not a system. It's, a system. it's not a system. Because we see the people that you get your knowledge. Do you know there's a there's a description? Let me let me say. No, this isn't a hadith. The mosques that you go to, I know, uh, yeah. the Molvis that sit in the what Molvis? What Molvis? I would. The, your imams, the ones that the, the ones that yeah. look after your mosque, yeah. they sit in the mosque, yeah. and what they're doing is uh -huh. they're deceiving people. La, because we challenge our imams. They are lying in the mosque. Part of part of. Part of the people, part of being, part of, part of, part of, a, part of the education of a Muslim is to, uh, to, is to challenge what is, what is, what, what the imams are telling us. Habibi, look, look. When we, when we sit at the feet of our scholars, when we sit at the feet of our scholars and we learn from them, we ask them, we challenge them, we say, where did you, which hadith is this in? Which, which ayah is this? It's very bad. Yeah, look, <laughs> the scholars don't deceive us. Do you know why? Do you know why? Because when we say, because students of knowledge, when they sit at the feet of the scholars, they ask them questions. Uh, you're, tell, you're telling me this. What is the evidence for this? What is the evidence for that? This is what we do with our scholars, right? When we sit and study with them. Ask any student of knowledge. Okay. Right? Let me, let me keep no, they don't. Murabbis. They don't have scholars. They have murabbis. Murabbi means uh, just a teacher. Just a yeah, Murabbi is someone that teaches. You don't have ulama. You don't, you, you don't have anyone that is, is known as an ulama, as an alim. Let me tell you who's bigger than all ulama. Israel founder. And scholars. Who? Khalifa. Who is Khalifa? Since when? You don't even have a Khalifa. You have normal people sitting inside your mosque lying regularly, lying, lying, lying. Who is Khalifa? You know, and you don't believe them. No. Look, let us, let us, let us not bring in the fact that, that what do you call it, that your current Khalifa has been uh, involved in a, in a rape scandal. Yes, let us exactly. not, let us not uh, uh, so bring into the, let, it's not lies. This is all lies. It's, it's not lies. Dijal. It's not all Dijal. Dijal. We heard the recordings. Oh, come on, yes, I heard. You heard the recordings, isn't it? We heard the recordings, Habibi. Even the sisters speaking. Okay. You don't believe. What do we believe? Right, look, we, look, your, your, your current Khalif has, has been found out for embezzling funds from your own chanda. Yeah, your chanda that you pay is a membership. So you don't pay chanda. You don't pay chanda. You don't pay chanda. You do pay chanda. Taib, so where am I lying? The thing that you're lying about is that you are saying that we... It's proven. Who's the Khalifa? The Khalifa has been... He denied He denied. He denied that... that. What was her name? Nair... I forgot her name. Yeah, I forgot her name. But he denied that it would call it happen because it was a member of his own family. Allah, he denied. Allah, he denied. He's a prophet. 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 Look, in the Quran, look, in the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says about Isa, He says, uh, Right? He is, a, he is uh, Isa himself is a sign of the hour. Okay? Now this comes twofold. When he was born and when he returns. 
Because when he was born, this was a sign of, of the closest of the hour. Likewise, the birth of the Rasul was a sign of the closest of the hour. Likewise, the, the splitting of the moon, you know, was, is, a, is a sign of the closeness of the hour. Hold on, hold on. The was soon physical. Huh? It was a physical. What? Uh, splitting of the moon. Yes. It happened. So, so, so it happened uh, physically. Physically. Do you believe that? No, he doesn't. No, no, don't worry about Abilif, man. <laughs> no, he doesn't. Brother, I'm trying to... Any miracle, any supernatural event, they do not believe. They don't believe. They don't believe. So uh, I'll tell you something, right? When it comes to Isa, uh, to Musa A.S., when he put his stick in the in the ocean and it split apart, th I've heard their explanation for it. They said that the wind, that, that the wind came in such a force that it split. That is one. My explanation is that what happened was you see the shores. Yes. You see the river itself. Yeah, but the, the, the wind needs to do that. The water, yes. it uh, decreased. Yeah, but how? So decreased. How? And when it was decreased, it, what decreased it, it? it gave a pathway for Musa to uh, escape. What, to split it? Not split. It was not physically split. It's impossible. It's possible, but it was not the law of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He's saying that Allah didn't do it. It was just the wind. But the thing is, you know it's the wind. You, the explanation is that the wind pushed the sea back. You not sit in your mosque and listen to big Maulvis with big beds or lying to you. No, mashallah, alhamdulillah, but he's telling the truth. He's telling the truth. Yeah, yeah. Of course he's Well, yeah, if I'm not telling the truth, why they accept me as a Muslim? If I'm lying to them, you know? So can I, you see it? So they accept yeah, you as a you, Muslim and look, you are, I, I tell you what, take, I mean, look, you take your Qadiani look, them, son. Take you your you cup off for a second them, and think. You are actually, they are blackmailing you and you actually you I don't have there. a Sunni cap. No, you, you, I've got no cap. Yeah. yeah. No, no, you, no. you, you, you read the Quran, no. you, you read it yourself. Not their one, no. Islam, Islam. Allah one. subhanahu wa ta'ala says, ponder upon the Quran. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So I'm asking you to think. But you yeah. don't, don't, man. We do. You don't. We do. We do. No. This is why we know, this is why we will. Uh, Alhamdulillah, me and, me and the Saudi brother, we, we've been blessed with the, uh, knowing the Arabic language. They have showed me that Isa did not die and he went up alive. No. I have. Yeah. I have. It is. Where? Yeah. I have. Like you you spoke to him last week, yeah, yeah I know. I, I saw the video. Yeah. <laughs> you know, they are, they, if he didn't want was it, to put on was the Was it not with you? I saw him on die. video with someone. And I thought it was you. Allah, Rafa, Allah. Oh, yeah, it was Hashim. It was Hashim. Yeah. What is Rafa? Rafa, Rafa Allah, I mean, Allah, Allah to him. No, he's saying only the rule. Oh, no. But what's, 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 what's a good thing? If, if I allow okay. me to die, that guy spoke out of it. When I told him about Rafa, he knows him as Rahu. No, he doesn't. He didn't run away. He was here for a very long time afterwards. Oh, he ran away. Look, told you. look he I'm an Arab as well. We were both confused. What, what is this connection that you're he trying knows to make? His Rafa means Ruhu. Look, no, it's not. Well, they, they have their own translation. They mix up everything. You know, they haven't got a clue about it. I know. They that. don't believe Quran. I know they, they don't. They don't believe Hadith. They don't believe Islam. I know. They want to split Muslim. They want to, you know, mix sway Muslim. Yeah, 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 they make yeah, 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 they yeah, yeah, no, no, they, they want to, you know, split Muslim. No. And actually, you shouldn't be, a, you know, having a debate with these guys because they are completely brainwashed. I'm not debating him. I'm just letting him know no, that what his, he his stuff is wrong. But he don't want to know. He doesn't know. Yeah. The thing is, the thing is, the, 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 he is ignorant, exactly. Well, he, 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 uh, unfortunately, the thing is, what they accuse us of, of being ignorant and brainwashed by our mullahs and mulvis, that's the, exactly what's happening to them. They murabbis, they say, don't ask questions. Yeah, yeah. Don't ask questions. When Just I believe. ask questions, when I went there, you know, they, 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 they actually black blackmail their own, yeah. yeah. They blackmail, they're trapped, and you know, this is what they yeah. do. You know, you have people have to be, that's why I come here, let them know, you know, because Qadiani is a fact, fact it's a fake religion, yeah. it's, but they have Quran in their hand, and they talk about Quran, a simple Muslim, maybe, you know, they say, oh, they are good, you know, because the, they look good. The thing is, you know, the, yeah, the Qadianis have actually been caught attempting tahrif on the Quran. Oh, yeah, yeah, I showed him, mm. uh, I showed him this, one of his, uh, uh, one of his ilham, he said, mm -hmm. he used one ayah mm -hmm. and two ayah together, and there, you know, he's saying, he said, this yeah. is the Quran. Of course it is the Quran. What is it oh. in uh, Libran? I don't and know, what is I don't know about them until today. Yeah. Yeah. You look into them, you'll see how crazy their beliefs become. Yeah. They're in they're, uh, yeah, they're very spread in Africa. They've got a very strong. No, 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 uh, no, 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 in Africa, in South America. Yeah, it's all nice. On one hand, on top of that, 